I honestly wouldn't write out this diagram on the test for this probably, um, just because I think looking at the information, you can tell the answer um, just by thinking logically and not writing out too much. But I wanna write it out to depict what's going on just so we have like a visual as part of this explanation. So we are being asked, how many people in a group of 50 own neither a fax machine nor a laser printer? So F no, P no, which would be this yellow box here in our Venn diagram grid. So uh, looking at statement one, basically what statement one is telling us is that the number we're looking for is greater than zero because the total number of people who own a fax machine or a laser printer or both would be, so a fax machine, but not a laser printer, a fax machine, uh, I mean, a printer, but not a fax machine, and then both would be like here. If those two add up to less than 50, then this must add up to something because the interior four quadrants here have to add up to the total. And that means they have to add up to 50. So looking at this, I basically know that the X, the yellow coordinate here is greater than zero. And that's why I wrote it this way. That tells me nothing about the value. This is a data sufficiency value question. We have to nail it. Statement two on its own says PYF, FY, so the overlap, which is C in our situation, is 15. Well, that doesn't tell me anything about these other three quadrants, except that together they add up to 35. So I definitely can't isolate X, that's insufficient. Now, taking these two together, this adds no value to this and vice versa. Because in this situation, if you tell me that X is a positive number, I still don't know what it is. It could be anything between, between one and 35. And Basically, I'm not able to isolate it and I see it's insufficient and our answer is answer choice E. So looking at the information, I don't think I even need to write it out. I kind of see at a high level. I'm not getting that much granular information. This is a value question. We have to nail it. So it's, it's insufficient even when taken together. And that leads us to an E answer.